Hey, what's going on guys? Thanks for checking out today's video. So today we're going to start with a quick war recap, or maybe not a quick one. For me, this is probably kind of long, but we're going to watch a few war replays here. Um, let's see what this one is. Drag bat. Now, Invernal is coming in here with a drag bat, and this strategy is super strong uh, right now in the game because the dragon's got a buff, as you all know. Now, I've found that people who are good with these dragons are really hard to defend because if they can cut uh, the good enough pathing for the dragons, if there's any bat value in the base, it seems like the dragons just don't die. So let's see what he does here. E drag on one side of the funnel and heroes on the other, and then he goes right at the town hall. Um, tornado at the town hall, use the warden. Just kind of pushing his way through. Use the king ability. Everybody's going to be going pretty much right into the middle of the base. He pulled the hound CC. Now he starts the bats. This seems really early to me, but he starts him here anyway. And freezes up the wizard tower. He has four freezes, which is a lot. And this base does have a single target inferno. He still is going to freeze down there because of the wizard tower. But look at this. A lot of defenses down there. Dragon's taking down the queen. Depends on the bat path here. If they go straight for the wizard tower, it's good. Oh, he missed it. I mean, we know it's a triple, but... Wow. All the bats are dead, and he gets it from here. A minute of cleanup. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Look at all this. Got a good split on those dragons, too. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'm going to go ahead and times four all the cleanup here. Nice hit, Invernal. Really nice. Really, really nice. Okay, let's see what's next. This one, Sir Fox. Coming in with the Mass Ghost. This attack is so overpowered right now. So OP. If you're not, if you're wanting to get triples, yeah, easy triples, start with Mass Ghost because right now they are so strong. I think most people aren't even wasting their time trying to defend the Ghost. I know I'm really not. So, um, see, he's got a Witch CC. A lot of people running Witches too, probably because of Dragons. To be honest, there are still a fair amount of Hounds, but. I feel like there's a lot more witches than there used to be. Okay. So he's basically cutting all the trash or clearing all the trash around the town hall. And he's having the ghosts go ahead and target that directly. Now he's going after the splash damages. So he's going to go after that multi-target inferno. He's getting that wizard tower down. There he goes. We're going to go times two because the ghosts go kind of slow. Okay, so he's sending in the wrecker with the heroes as kind of a kill squad. He's also sending in ghosts at the same time to target this inferno tower over here. The one thing I can tell you about the mass ghost is it is easy to time fail. So you kind of got to have two irons in the fire going at the same time. Queen's going to grab that. Uh, wizard tower that's in there pretty deep so now he only has really two splash to worry about so he starts his bats at nine in basically a wave and he dumped them all on the um, archer but um it creates the wave as he comes through here nice he's got so many freezes he just frees up everything the whole time and not really be worried about it wow Queen. Look at the health on that queen. That is crazy. And he had ghosts to spare. So even if his bats didn't clear the base, he still had a chance. That's, it's really strong. <laughs> Alright, so we saw this one. Um, I believe this is the one I made a video about. It sure is. Alright, let's move up. Let's see what Lee did. Lee also did the mass ghost, which we're going to go times two because the ghosts are a little bit slow to start. 
moving in again clearing out around the town hall so that he can easily take down the town hall with the ghosts and then focus his kill squad probably on the eagle if i had to guess yep he's cutting that funnel on the back end right now oh and he's going after that inferno pulled the cc again ice witch baby archers here we go. Bring in the heroes. Poison to make sure he gets the witch. Not really worried about the rest of that CC. Oh, the queen walks. It's probably not the worst thing to be honest, although I don't think he gets both infernos like that. But I guess that's why he has so many freezes, right? There he goes. Bat bomb. Boom, boom. Oh, that ice golem froze that wizard tower too. Great timing. <laughs> and he froze it with his free spell, it looks like, too. All right, so that's going to do it for that. Nice hit, Lee. Um, Yolo Baggins. Coming in with the hybrid 2.0. Okay, so let's see. Looking at this base, do you think you know what he's going to do with the hybrid 2.0? So he starts his queen up here, um, right around, we'll say 230. And he's going to push in. He clears a funnel with the ghosts. But he's going to push in with the queen, past the town hall, get the king. And now he's got the CC pulled out, thanks to the ghosts. Okay, poison down. The hound goes down pretty quick when the queen's under rage, so not a problem at all. And minion for the healers to be saved from those pups. Here they go, troops working down. That wizard out there is pretty clutch. He didn't even need this miner out here. Slam her down. Let's see how far the slammer gets. Oh, runs into the sweeper. Rage up the queen. He's coming up on the enemy queen right now. Puts the jump down. No big deal. Slammer didn't break me in. I can use the jump. Nice. This is great. The king starts his funnel on the other side of the town hall. He's basically trimming the, the base for the miners and the hogs now. So it looks like the miners and the hogs are going to split. Miners are going to go for the town hall. Hogs are kind of out there on the outside doing their own business. Okay. Queen's still cleaning up the top or the bottom half of the base. That's basically what she's going to be responsible for. There is a single target inferno down there. So sadly, because he had to use the ability there, the queen is going to die. And there she goes, but he's going to get that OP healer switch onto the hogs. Here they go. Rages him up through that farm. Very nice. And now the healers are tanking the single target Inferno. And this base looks like it's pretty much crushed. Hybrid 2.0, man, so strong. I don't think most people look at this base and think hybrid, but Yolo Baggins, he just gets it, man. He does. That guy's a beast. Good job, Baggins. Okay, let's see where we're at. We got Emperor Sung. He's doing the mass ghost with the bats. What are they? The royal, do they call that royal bats? Something like that. And the formula is simple. Clean up the trash around the town hall, ghost the town hall down, and then use your heroes to get the splash damage uh, away from the town hall. So he's probably going to go for those two inferno towers. But we'll see. I haven't seen this raid, so I don't know what he's going to do. His ghosts are getting a ton of value up there. He's getting wizard tower down. Clearing that top compartment or that one o'clock compartment. 
probably going to send two for the town hall here pretty soon. There he goes. Okay, what's going to be next? Mr. Sung. Okay, he's got more ghosts clearing up trash on the outside. I think he's going to go for this inferno up here. Got his heroes coming down over here. Okay, I thought they were going to come for this double inferno, but he wants this inferno and two wizard towers. Smart. And probably get to the eagle with that record too. CC's finally going down. It's been just kind of getting pulled left and right because of the ghosts, but made short work of that. Oh, he's not going to get to the eagle. But the bats will get there. Here he comes, bat wave right at the eagle. There we go. It's smart to take down the eagle first. A lot of people go for those uh, inferno towers right away, but... There we go. Got plenty of freezes to take all this down. Oh, didn't even need that freeze. Swagged it. Does he realize he has another freeze? <laughs> A little late on that freeze, buddy. It's all right. He still gets it down anyway. Nice triple. Nice triple. Swagged two freezes, really. Um, Thanos. Let me guess. Peck a bow bat. Yep. Coming in backside all the way away from the town hall. That was a terrible funnel he cut, too, and everybody still goes in. Hmm. A good amount of them. Wow. Let's see what these packers decide to do. Oh, they went up into that compartment. Now they come back for the king. Queen's kind of doing her own little journey up in the top of the base where there's nothing there. Bats are coming around. He still has all those packets alive, so he's going to get to that town hall pretty easy. Oh, and the king. Jeez. <laughs> he's got a lot of firepower right there. And that queen doing OP cleanup on the back end, too. That actually worked out to help him a lot. Hmm. Beautiful raid. And times four, it's basically just clean up. I know it's the town hall's still up, but it's not going to make much difference against all those Pekkas or the queen. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow. Looked ugly there for a second, but ends up getting it. Kalugo. Let's see what he's going to do. Looks like Pekka Smash. So E drag to funnel one side. Let's see what he does to funnel the other. Maybe a Pekka, maybe the king. There it is, Pekka. So he's gonna start the rest of the troops here pretty soon. Wall wrecker in and two jumps. Hmm. That's a lot of uh, a lot of access into the base. Probably going to be able to jump all the way across the base now. There he goes. Rage it up at the town hall. Warden takes it down. Everybody's looking good. CC comes out. Same thing it's been. Ice witch baby archers. Not going to slow these guys down too much. Healers under rage. Keeping everything alive. King has cleaned one heck of a funnel there on the outside. He's on trash duty really and the Pekkas are jumping through the base uh, those two jumps gave him access to pretty much the whole base pretty strong man strong he's got four Pekkas and the king with the healers and the queen with their ability yeah this base is in a lot of trouble looking good though it's a nice hit Kalugo not bad not bad at all. His Pekkas came back inside. Wow, that's nice. My Pekkas are never that smart. <laughs> You'll see. I'm going to be in a couple of live streams soon that my Pekkas are never that smart. All right. Let's see. 
We got Wolf again. We already saw a Wolf raid. We're going to watch another one. Sammy. Sammy has a YouTube channel. I've mentioned him before. He's a great attacker. Going to times two this. You've got Warden Walk into Witches, it looks like. Okay. Takes a minute for that Warden to get all that stuff cleared out. He's got the King for the other side of the funnel with a Witch. And they're all going to meet in the middle over here. Yep. There they all go. Use the Warden to save them from that initial Inferno. And make sure he has the pathing to get where he needs to go. If you get the healers onto the Witches, they're basically invincible. Unless the Eagle gets them. I mean, they're not invincible, but they're they're really hard to take down. The base suffers, you know. Town Hall down. Most of the bats are down, but he's got cleanup. This this is a well planned, well executed raid. Which is row P. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're gonna fast forward through all the cleanup. We know it's a triple, so we'll just see how it's done. Pretty good stuff. Pretty good stuff. All right, what's gonna be next? Got Trident. You remember Trident from the perfect CWL? He went seven for seven. He's also doing the drag bat. Now he's starting with his king and queen up here at the twelve o'clock. See which way they end up going. Oh, they end up splitting. Not the worst thing, really. Get an air defense either way. And then what's next? Mm-hmm. Oh, almost got that wizard tower. All right, dragons in at the town hall with the slammer. Uh, the sweepers are both facing away from the town hall. That's super risky. And here he goes, just going to push his way through. The dragons are going to take down the queen, both those wizard towers. He bat bombs the multi, freezes that wizard tower. Slammer gets the eagle. Plenty of bats to get through this back end. Ooh, hit a red bomb. Still a few bats left. And now it's up to the dragons. Let's see what's going to happen here. Going to be up to these three drags. Oh, wow, those two dragons were full health. Nice. Great raid, Trident. Great raid. Okay, let's see. And the last one is me. Uh, hitting another Itsu base. So, you know what? We may make a video about that. I did record that live. I could show it here, but I'm going to make a video about it probably. So here we are, final score 63 to 54. We have 13 triples, which is pretty good for us. And yeah, so that's going to do it for today. I don't do a lot of war recaps. I'm not really good at them, but kind of want to shout out my guys and just showcase how good they've been lately. So, all right, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys for checking it out, and I will see you in the next one.